Hi guys and welcome to this video. So today I'm going to be showing you the best audio programs to record your radio shows. So the programs we're going to see are pretty easy to use and they'll allow you to pre-record your shows or podcasts for your radio station. So the first program we're going to look at is called Audacity. You've probably heard of it before as it's one of the most popular softwares used for audio recording. At the top of your screen, you have the main buttons that will allow you to stop, play, or record your sound. Over here are the different volume buttons that will allow you to adjust your recording volume and playback volume. This line underneath displays the input and output devices. Your audio tracks are displayed in the main part of your screen here. To record, simply click on the red recording button and begin speaking. To stop your recording, simply click on the stop button. Another popular program for audio recording is GarageBand. You can easily add effects to your voice and drag your jingles in to edit your show. When you open the software, you'll see several templates. So choose Voice. So just like with Audacity, the bar at the top will allow you to start, stop and record your audio tracks. On the left hand side, you'll see the different effects that can be applied to your voice. Narration vocal and na natural vocal are probably the best two options if you want your voice to sound normal without any effects. Here you can customise the presets of your recording. To record, simply click on the red recording button and begin speaking. To stop your recording, just click on the stop button. The great thing about Reaper is the extreme customization of the software. It's really useful if you want to edit your shows after recording. So they offer a free 60 day trial and you can purchase a discounted license for $60 and a commercial license for $225. To insert a track, right click on the dark grey part on the left hand side and click on insert new track. To arm your track for recording, click on the recording button. To start your recording, click on the red button on the bottom of your interface. You can also start and stop your tracks here. So Soundtrap is an online platform initially intended for music creators. The tool is so intuitive and practical that it could also become a major ally in the creation and recording of a radio show. So once you've created your account, you'll have access to your profile. So in this area, you can see your current projects and even collaborate on another project with other users. So to start your project, simply click on Enter Studio. So Soundtrap does offer a free 14 day trial and otherwise subscriptions can vary from $4.79 a month up to $14.39 a month. So once we're here, we're simply going to select blank template and to add a new track on the left hand side, click on add new track. So seeing as we're going to record a radio show, I'm going to select voice and microphone. And down here, you can select your input device. You can also add special effects to your voice, but seeing as we're just doing a normal radio show today, I'm going to select podcast. So here on the right hand side, you can also customize your audio levels. And what's really cool with Soundtrap is that you can save your presets to make sure that each time you use it, your audio levels are always the same. To start recording, we're going to click here and they'll automatically ask you if you're using headphones or not. So here's a countdown to the recording. We can close this and then start speaking. Once you finish speaking, simply click on the stop button. So here we have our audio track and you can download it by clicking on this button here. And there you have it. You now know how to record your radio shows with the various programs. So what are you waiting for? Do you want to create an online radio station? Radio King offers you a free 7-day trial, no commitment. 
You can find the link in the description below.